Okay, this is Cool Dude Claim with more computer woes. Now, I said I wasn't going to upload any more videos onto YouTube anymore until that cartoon of mine is done. But, yes, I'm having more computer trouble, and YouTube is the only place I know of where I can actually get the help I need. Now, I'm trying to do a clean reinstall of Windows XP. I've got Windows 7 off here as well, because, well, I'm going to reinstall that after I've reinstalled Windows XP, so I have the two operating systems. Thing is, I've got a ton of crap on Windows XP that I want to get rid of. Some things I've downloaded, and some of those things I downloaded, instead of downloading the thing, the program itself, it downloads a downloader for the thing, which is probably infested with spyware. Plus, I've got tons of other crap on this computer that it would just be easier to do a clean reinstall than to just get rid of them. Anyway, this is the thing. It gets to this screen on the Windows XP install and is completely unresponsive to the keyboard. It says to set up Windows XP now, press enter. So I press enter and nothing happens. I can press this a million times and still it hangs at this screen. I don't know if it's crashed or if it's not responding to my keyboard. None of the other buttons do. If I press F3 to quit, that doesn't do anything. If I press R, that doesn't do anything. Why is that stupid moth on this screen now? No, it's not a moth, it's a thing. It's completely not responsive to the keyboard. And I can prove this keyboard's working. If I just reboot the computer, sorry about the <coughs> weird shot here. Go into the bias. Okay, I forgot what delete button is, so I'm just gonna go through these like this. Okay. So now in the bias, and as you'll probably know, that needed to respond to the keyboard to do that. And if I go, if I press things on the keyboard, you can see I can go into the different menus and things. And I'll show you how I've got the USB configuration done because it's a USB keyboard. Look at this. Everything. I have enabled everything. In a vain attempt to get this stupid keyboard to respond in Windows XP. It's always worked before. But for some reason this time when I tried to reinstall Windows XP it's not going to do it. And I don't know why. Anyway, I hope this time the camera actually makes a file that's not corrupted. Now I can upload to YouTube. Last time I tried to show this, the stupid memory ran out. And even so, the camera made a corrupted file that wasn't playable. So I hope, anyway, this time I'll be able to upload this to video YouTube and ask for your help. Because this is really making me PO'd now.